Hey, it's Wes. I just want to make a real quick video. I've been working on the rarities for my crypt creepy crypto jack-o'-lanterns. Long story short, I listed these, you have to remember, almost a year ago on uh, Tofu NFT. And they've now been listed also on Refinable, and I have my own store there. Now, what's interesting about this, and this is really blowing me away, is I had an expectation as to what would be the most rare ones, and I was wrong. Basically, the way it works now is like this. I, I took the, the, I guess for lack of a better way of calling it, the uh, formula of one divided by the number of times that particular trait shows up divided by the number in the complete set. And what I came up with is this uh, form here. And I'm gonna to try to share all these links in the video whenever I get it uploaded. Uh, long story short, I created a top 10, top 101 to 150, which is roughly the top 20, 25, and on so. Um, the reason I stopped at 35 on the bottom end of this list is because 35 happens to be the actual average on all of this. The most rare of all of these is actually this uh, number 497. And what amazed me, it does not have swag. In fact, most of the top 10 does not have that swag element. And I've thought a lot about that. And I think the reason why is because there's so few of them, the likelihood of them having other traits that were super rare is just not there. Uh, so it's just kind of one of those weird things that it's just kind of worked out that way. What I did notice, though, is that they are consistently in the top. Oh, let's say this is probably the top. Uh, uh, just take a guess. They're consistently in the top 65 of all of them. So they are consistently in the top, but they are not the very top rarity wise. So if you see one of them with the swag, yeah, they're definitely on the more rare uh, side. Uh, definitely better than the average. The average on this is actually right at 35, which is where I cut this off at. Um, and of course, a person can go through here and, and do all the sorting and everything themselves. All the information is right here. Uh, the reason why this one, in fact, these top three are so rare is because of the background. It's one of the more rare backgrounds. So the next background, uh, it's just mind boggling to me. I think the next rarest background is this four color and it has 21 in the total set. Now, also, this is the calculations I did. I did it programmatically here within the form and I deleted all of my work after the fact just to kind of clean up the form some. Double check me because I've done this a couple different ways and I'm not the best at the programming. But what I did should be very, very accurate and close to these. I did it two different ways whenever I did this programmatically. And they were both within, you know, five points of each other. But a couple of them did get skewed a little heavier than others. But this is the one, if I did it on my calculator and I did it that way, this is what it came up closest to. So I went with that on the uh, programmatic side. But anyways, it just amazes me that there's a lot of these that are actually very much available because I hate to say it, I didn't know which ones were the most rare. Now, of course, if you go back over here to Creepy Crypto Jacks, I did a lot of uh, airdrops. I did a lot of things like that. There's a lot of these that are still out there. They're very, very rare. If you go over to Rarible, of course, you know, obviously there's nowhere near as much many trades here. I just listed it on not too long ago. But you find all of these, and a lot of these are also available, and oftentimes at a very, very reasonable price. So I kind of find it interesting. Um, I just want to make a real quick video, and mostly because I'm really short on time right now, but I'd love to really try to work more promotion over this, especially the time of year that it is. But the other thing I want to mention is that I have got some other stuff coming down the pipe. And one of the big things is whenever this, a lot of this other stuff comes down, and I don't want to promise times because, like I said, I'm very, very busy. But when this other stuff comes out, the people who are holding this, they're going to be the first people who are going to be rewarded for having bought into this program. And I don't want to say or reveal too much yet because a lot of it, I'm not the best programmer and I don't want to build up something false. I, I basically, I don't want to overhype something and then under deliver. I'd much rather under hype it and over deliver because whenever that happens, I think that's just, just to me, it's a better way to go. So anyways, I'm going to cut this one short. I just want to share all this with you and just kind of showcase some of the stuff I've been working on. And most importantly, I think this here just kind of blew me away. This top 10 just just absolutely shocked me on what was actually there. I appreciate you all. Have a great day.